for joining us for another Freedom of Mind Community Choir Session. We sing because it makes us feel good and member or non-member we hope you find this session leaves you feeling a bit better. We're going to start today by thinking about our breathing so if you just pop your hand above your tummy button and we're going to hiss out on an S until you've got no more breath left and then take a little pause just wait there once you've got no more it'll happen at different times for us uh, but when you've got no more breath left just hold for a couple of seconds and then relax and you should find that your breath just springs back out naturally so deep breath in through the nose and hissing out And what you should notice is as you're hissing, your tummy's kind of deflating a bit like a balloon, letting air out. And, um, and then after you relax, you should naturally breathe in and feel your tummy expanding again. We'll try that one more time. And then you can practice this in your own time. It's a really nice thing to do on a daily basis. And I'm sure you'll find the more you do it, the longer you're able to make that hiss last for. Here we go, deep breath in. And hissing out. I'm very tempted to tell a balloon joke, but I'm not going to. Okay, last thing we're going to do is shh, shh, shh. So rather than hissing, a kind of hard shh, as if you're angry and you want someone really to be quiet. And we'll try to do that about 10 times. Okay, one deep breath in and then 10 shh out. Here we go. Okay, and you should really feel your tummy working there as you're pushing the air out hard. Next thing we're going to do is to try and stretch your voice gently. We'll do evil moustache, which you may well remember from previous sessions. So first of all, we'll rub our hands together, we'll get the blood flowing and energy going, but we'll really be thinking of a wicked plan. And then we're going to tweak our massive moustache by humming from low in our voice up to as high in our voice as possible, and then break into a wicked laugh to finish. Okay, you ready? Mm. <laughs> okay, and just because it's fun, we'll do it a second time. <laughs> Good stuff. Now, you might also remember Fred. He has a head like a ping pong ball. And we've sung about him before. The words are, Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Ping pong, ping pong ball. And that goes like this. Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Fred has a head like a ping pong ball. Ping pong, ping pong ball. And you'll notice I'm working really hard to articulate all the words clearly. The next section is the real challenge. We're going to sing ping pong, ping pong. section okay I'm sure you'll catch on no bother okay here we go To revisit cough biro which we started working on last time and just as a wee recap this is a song from Kenya and it means the rain is coming bring in the cattle and the melody which we learned before and you can always go back to the previous video if you've missed this but just a very quick recap for everybody there are two sections this is the first section Three times. 
strings. Then there's the second section, which goes two times and then we go back to the first section for three further times. So today what I'd like to introduce is a high and a low harmony to go with this. So we'll work on the same amount as we did the last time. We're going to have three of the first section, two of the second section and three of the third section, well which is a repeat of the first section. And um, I'd like to go over a harmony that you can sing above the first section just now and that is a, a high harmony. So melody starts here. First time round, just hear the melody, and then we'll introduce a high harmony if you'd like to sing a harmony which sits above. times round um, that first section of the piece and then we go to the and then there's a harmony to add in the second time round which starts on the same beginning note so it just doesn't move off that first note and then it's going to move down one note and back up again. So this low harmony here goes And then we're back to our first section. So with the melody and the high harmony above for three further times. So you can decide today, you can stick with the melody that you learned before, or you can join me today in singing the harmonies, which comes in on the second time through um, at the beginning, and then the second time through in the second section, and then all three times through the final time round, the first section of the song. That sounds confusing, it'll be easier if I just play it. start melody only, everybody on the melody, and then the second time round if you want to, you can move into the high harmony. Thank you. 
open. Now that we've learned the melody and today the harmony lines, next time we'll work through the whole piece with a longer arrangement. For today though, I'd like to sing through a song we have looked at before, but in case it's your first time, I'm going to teach the first verse. This is a song that's in our repertoire at Freedom of Mind Community Choir, and it's called How Can I Keep From Singing? Seems appropriate at the moment. We almost um, had a way forward for meeting outdoors together, but now it feels like it's back to online again. So you'll probably be seeing a few more of these sessions on YouTube coming up. So verse one, the words are all underneath the video if you want the words for the whole thing, but I'll teach verse one, my turn, your turn. My life rolls on in endless song. My life rolls on in endless song. Above earth's lamentations, above earth's lamentations, I hear the I hear the real, the far off hill that hails a new creation, that hails a new creation. Let's sing that full section together now. My life goes on. song now through all the tumult. One, two. verse 2 and 3 which have the same melody. At the very beginning we've got a hummed part you may wish to join in with. The higher of the two lines is or the lower line is okay and also at the end we have a hummed section, a hummed kind of outro. We end up how can I keep
again for humming. The lower line goes. And again, that repeats four times. So let's sing that together. song now. If it's new to you, you can join in with the first verse and the humming, or if you know it, you can sing the whole thing or give it a bash, even if it's new to you. Stay well, hopefully see you soon.